You know the old saying, nobody loves like an Irishman. He's so precise in every little thing he does. Like he really has me on a pedestal. He knows if he gets a bit bossy, I'm not gonna listen. Oh, he'll still get there, like with muffins at the wheel. He's an excellent cook. All the guards are mad after him. He can kick the ball so high up in the clouds. I fall in love more and more every day with him. If he's hurting, I'm hurting. And he said, I'm standing here, praying for you. That was my daddy, Seamus. You're not meant to do that. Do this, do that. You have to drink your milk. What did you move that for? I was looking at it. So I said I'll have to tie him now to the table. He'll be after all the young ones now. But then in saying that, he does try. And he likes to be where you are and he likes to know where you're going. And Clean up that room! I needed to say how proud I was of him. And then he was texting me for ages and ages and then it kind of all went off and I wasn't talking to him and then he texted me the other day. <laughs> and then we come together <laughs> at night time in bed. <laughs> So that's the thing he still has to do. <laughs> and he said, I hope this dance never ends. And so we're still dancing. I can't bring him back. I'm able to handle him. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. See, he has me spoiled. Huh? It's just something between the two of us. I suppose he wants to spend the rest of his life with me. <laughs>